The Miami Dolphins. The Miami Dolphins are in a very turbulent place right now. Their starting quarterback is out due to a concussion. He is out for at least another week or two, uh, presumably for the rest of the season. Skylar Thompson, the backup quarterback, goes down mid-second quarter, and the uh, Miami Dolphins looked all but lost on Sunday, ultimately losing to the, to the Seattle Seahawks 24-2-3. The defense looked flat. The team looked, looked flat. At, at, nothing was clicking for the Miami Dolphins on Sunday. They almost had that midseason funk where you just forget to show up, except for it's not midseason, it's week three. So, guys, is it fact or is it crap that the Miami Dolphins season is officially over after the two game losing streak, losses to the Buffalo Bills, and loss to the Seattle Seahawks on Sunday? When we look at the Miami Dolphins, guys, their defense looked terrible on Sunday. I'm not saying that the Seattle Seahawks are a bad team. I think they're a pretty good team. They are might make some noise to a nice little playoff push. But the simple fact of the matter is, is the Miami Dolphins defense was ranked fourth in total defense going into week three. What they do week three, they allow 289 pass, passing yards to Geno Smith and Char Bonnet. Is that he say 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 his name Char Char Bonnet, the backup running back for the Seattle Seahawks, had 91 yards rushing. The Seahawks actually ultimately had 111 yards rushing. The defense looked flat. The defense looked lost. The defense looked terrible. The offense looked terrible. Tyree Kill had three catches. Jalen Waddle had three catches on five targets. Guys, the Miami Dolphins just looked a lot alike. Uh, uh, what? What? Guys, if the Miami Dolphins do not win versus the Tennessee Titans on Monday night foot to foot to football next week, their season is completely done. Their season is completely over. But, but with that being said, factor crap is their season over after this week three loss to the Seattle Seahawks. I'm going to say crap. I think it is a crap because they have a pretty favorable schedule moving forward. They do play the 0-3 Titans coming up on Monday Night Football next week. They do travel to New England, which is 1-2. and two. Not a very good team. They do play the Colts. The Colts have a good defense. Offices are still, still trying to find themselves a little bit. Could be a good game. Then they play the Cardinals. Then they play a Rams team that's kind of a sinking ship right now. The Raiders, we don't know how good or how bad they actually are. So the Miami Dolphins have some time to figure themselves out. But if they go on a three-game losing streak, losing to the Bills, losing to the Seahawks, and losing to the Titans, then it is all but over. So that question is a little bit premature, but I saw a lot of Miami Dolphins fans basically saying, oh, we're fine. We're fine. We're fine. We're fine. I want to say slow it down. So, guys, Factor Crap is the Miami Dolphins season over. Laura says fact. Fact, she says. Miami Dolphins is not playing good football. Casey says the Fins are in the better luck next year bracket. Ooh, damn. Carson Lang says the Miami Dolphins might as well change their name to the Titanics because they are sunk. <laughs> they are sunk. But John says crap. It says, slow it down, baby. They may have lost to the Seahawks and look terrible. They may have lost to the Buffalo Bills and look terrible. They may have, may have barely beat a terrible Jacksonville Jaguars team, but slow it down. Slow it down, baby. It's crap. They're not seasons over yet. Wait till it loses to the Titans. <laughs> Pepe says, my friend wants to know if the Dolphins are cooked. I think the Dolphins are on the grill. The chef is getting ready to chop the head off, and it's getting hot. It's getting a little hot in here. So let, let me ask you guys this question. Let's say the Miami Dolphins do only get maybe five wins this season, maybe six. Is Mike McDaniels out? Is Mike McDaniels on the hot seat? Not because of just of, just of this season. 
but the overall performance the last couple years. I saw a stat somewhere where he is 1-11 in since taking over versus winning teams for the Miami Dolphins. 1-11 in against winning teams. And then you're getting beat like this. Is Mike McDaniels on the hot seat? I, I think he is. I think he is. John says the Hawks are flying right now. Defense definitely looked terrible. Miami Dolphins defense looked terrible. And Carson says the running back's name is pronounced Charbonnet. Charbonnet. Like the, is it a Charbonnet like a wine? <laughs> uh, moving on, moving on. 